in eight to 10 years, I think our community can be substantially different. And I think we have a lot of good things happening currently, and I think we have very good leadership. But I think what this does is gives us yet another catalyst in order for our community to go from what some could argue as good to a great community, where we're enticing, we're recruiting, we're retaining world-class talent, world-class companies, all different sizes, and all different environments uh, right here in Southwest Indiana. If you create a vibrant hub, a vibrant core to your city, growth will spurt from that, from that hub, and you will find corridors of, devel of development spiking out from that hub. Well, I think regional cities has been the catalyst. Um, Forbes just tabbed us as the number four city for millennials to, to start and own a business. And that to me says eight to 10 years from now, we're seeing businesses that are thriving, preferably would be dr uh, thriving downtown, right in the hub of all the activity. We have a terrific beauty here. We are centrally located. I see this being as an area where people come, they stay, we bring in new people and we keep people who are already here because it's the place to be. It's a good place to raise families, lots of opportunities in terms of education, in terms of business. Regional City is going to take us there in a hurry. We're going to be behind if we don't take action now. Now's the time that we need to get on board and really hear what the community has to say, hear what uh, millennials are doing, and look at what's going on nationally. We can be and will be a national competitor, and Regional Cities will help us get there. As a millennial who lives and works in downtown Evansville, I'm excited about a more vibrant community to keep me around. I truly believe that there's a bright future for the region um, where we're known for not only having but creating careers that are both challenging and rewarding in the STEM fields. Um, it's truly my hope that one day I no longer have to sell the region on our candidates that we are known throughout the Midwest and maybe throughout the Americas for being um, you know, a great place to have a career, a great place to live, and a great place to raise a family.